so often with trauma, especially if it has sexual sexual trauma, people are trying to process it alone mm-hmm. and because it's shameful to talk totally. about or they it's too triggering or for whatever reason. Yeah. And very often you cannot integrate something without the presence of a caring other, which is your partner or your therapist. That's a relationship again. Yeah. It's again relationship. And like Stan says, we get hurt in relationship, we heal in relationship. Yeah. And um, the value for anybody out there that's trying to do this from reading a book or trying to do this meditating or trying mm-hmm. to do this all by themselves, just even, I'm not saying you have to go out and spend tons of money, but even if you get a friend that is somewhat savvy and can be present with you, just try to work these yeah. things through with another caring, compassionate. And I would, I would vote for a trained therapist if it's possible sure. because it just goes so much faster. Just like you want to get your teeth work done, you're going to go to a dentist, you're not yeah. going to go to your neighbor, you know, right. or cardiologist. I just think it, if somebody really knows what they're doing, it, it, it lessens the suffering a lot. Yeah. Healing happens It's more faster, efficient. If that's possible. Straight up. But so many people do that healing in the context of their love relationship, yeah. which is also a huge opportunity yeah. for reworking this stuff. Yeah. 